I myself, I'm a dog lover. I love dogs. Yeah, but I... I, uh, I feel like people right now, they love their dogs a little bit too much. Yeah, it's getting a little... Oh, different people applauded. <laughs> different parts of that. Interesting. Uh, it's a little fetishy, and it's actually dangerous. And what I'd like to do tonight is I'd like to do an intervention on a, a dog owner who loves their dog a lot. Is there... Would you, you guys clapped excitedly about dogs. Can I talk to you tonight, ma'am? Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh, my God. I'm very excited. <laughs> You are into this. You just raised the roof. <laughs> Welcome to 1989, guys. Yes. Um, and so, ma'am, what's your name? Leslie. Leslie. And uh, what kind of a dog do you have, Leslie? A Staffordshire Terrier Rescue. Okay, you are exactly who I need to talk to. Ah, <laughs> uh, the fates have brought us together, Leslie, because... You won't even say you have a pit bull. You're like, you elevated up to American staff. Okay, I got it. All right. And, uh, and what's your uh, American staff or chair? <laughs> what's the ter ter Yeah, yeah, he knows. All 18 syllables. I get it. Thus the necessity for three parts. Dog's name? Barney. Barney. Okay. Um, wow. Every <laughs> you, you activated uh, the hormones of several women behind you. You want to give birth to pit bulls named Barney, apparently. <laughs> and so, is, is Barney a family name? Like, how did you pick the name Barney? He was already Barney when we rescued him. Oh, right, okay. And you've said rescue twice. I, I get it. You're, I'm in the presence of a hero. No, I, yeah, it's true. <laughs> Guys, we have a first responder, a friend. We have a nurse in the back. It's really an amazing show of heroes. <laughs> I don't even deserve to be here. Thanks for having me. So, so Leslie, I want you to imagine something. Imagine that your house catches on fire. You're already there. Look at you, very emotional. Everyone you love escapes with their life. Is this your husband? Yes. Okay, he's out. You're safe, everyone's safe. And you hear Barney, your American Staffordshire Terrier. <laughs> rescue <laughs> you hear Barney inside the house barking uh -huh. Leslie <laughs> would you run back in that fiery house to save Barney's life no I would send him no <laughs> Leslie you're not allowed to change the conditions that I've given you but I would go but sir, okay, listen, you're a dumb asshole. <laughs> and she's a smart asshole because she sacrificed your life. She's happy to see you go up into flames. No, you can't do that. You, you, you can't do that. Do you guys not see This Is Us? That's how Jack died. Yeah, L fucking let those dogs go. You gotta let Barney go. No. Yeah, yeah, guess what? There's a couple more pit bulls in shelters. There's a couple left. Guys, this goes for you, Leslie, everybody. All of your dogs are completely replaceable. Yes, they are. They are, I have proof. My dad over the course of his lifetime had five black labs named Pepsi. Five. When a Pepsi would die, my dad would go right to the pound and get a new Pepsi. He'd take the collar off the dead Pepsi. What are you moaning for? Collars cost money. And the information on the tags stays the same. Why do you want to waste my dad's money? Sometimes he wouldn't remember which Pepsi he was on. He forgot Pepsi 4 died once he thought Pepsi 5 lived 26 years. By the way, why can't these dogs get out of these houses? They got twice as many legs as us. How come Barney didn't smell the fire, Leslie? 
Barney can smell an ass from a thousand yards away, and you know that. <laughs> Don't go back for Barney. Never go back for the cat, because the cat set the fire in the first place. <laughs> Fact. Cats have nine lives. They would love nothing more than to waste one of them watching you burn to death. Every time you see your cat purring, it's remembering a previous owner <laughs> succumbing to flames. I know some of you guys are mad at me, but maybe we saved a life tonight and hopefully broke up this marriage. 32 years. 32 years. Sir, you survived 32 years. She's trying to get you.